went there and had her tell me all about it, and that sounded pretty good to me. Yeah. And I bought it. The alkalizing, High the oxygenation, and, yes, and the yes. detoxification. Mm -hmm. yep. Those are all the things that work. That's <laughs> what cancer can't live in. That's right. It's a fact. It's exactly it's a right. Thing. Yeah. Well, just like the people today that come out of Shannon gave me my phone number, uh -huh. and I talked to him, or, or the, I talked to the man, and he came out to my home, and I showed him a whole table of herbs, and, and uh, I told him my story. Right. And I let him taste the food that I eat, for, and everything, and uh, he went home, I, I, I had him, uh, Drink the water, yep. the whole bit, and, and I, I told him, I says, hey, I'm not telling you about this water, to, I'm a distributor, right. uh, but uh, I, I told him, I'm not trying to sell you this machine, mm -hmm. I want you to taste the water and know that that water helped me live. That's right. That's fact. That's right. And so I told him uh, uh, I got the machine from Kara Golden. Mm -hmm. so they can go, go there and, and uh, buy that machine. Yeah. But it, you know, yeah. it, it didn't matter to me. Right. Uh, to make a little money does, uh, is, it's life. I, I value <laughs> life. I, I gave three, about three hours talking to those people. Today, yeah, about three hours. Yeah. yeah. Well, and you've spent a few minutes now sharing yeah. with me your story on the video, which I yeah. thank you so much yeah. because there are so many people who really need this information and they want to hear it straight yeah. from somebody who has been in the trenches yeah. of yeah, battling know. basically terminal yeah. cancer. That's what it was. And you've come through, and your PET scan is now completely yeah. cancer free. Yeah. And so I can't thank you yeah. enough. For yeah. having the courage to do this little video because you're going to help a lot of people by hearing your story. And you can uh, uh, give my phone number to anybody and, and you, if they want want to talk to me or see my the stuff I have to take and all this. Yeah. I don't have to take any of that anymore. Right. But I still want to. Sure. Yeah. It's life giving. Yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So. Yeah. Yeah, any, uh, any, anytime anybody wants a little encouragement, uh, I'll, I'd be happy to talk to them if, well, they, if they want to come to me. You, or, you are an inspiration. Mm -hmm. And I do think uh, a critical point in, in what you've shared with me is when, when you basically went home, the doctor told you you're going to die, and you... You know, you kind of believed it for a minute Ooh, there. Two days. For two days, you know, the doctor told you were going to die. You believed it. You went home. You started cleaning out your house. And then you sat down. You, you were telling me this story from weeks ago. That you sat down and you thought about it. And you thought, I don't, you know, I don't know exactly. Will you tell me in your own words what I, what you decided I just, then or I just, realized? Or? I thought I was going to die. So I looked at the place and I thought to myself, uh, my son's going to have to come up here and since I'm such a pack rat, uh, <laughs> he's going to have to clean all this up because I've got a will to him, all my property and my home. And so I started throwing stuff into boxes and uh, plastic bags and, yeah. and throwing out everything and, and I was so sick. And, my glasses were a little loose and they fell into a box and I thought to myself, I don't need them. So I just left them in there and I 